I really do not know. I don't know. Um, I really do. I'm not sure, and I don't know. I am absolutely not sure, and I really don't know. Because the Zionists are the ones that funded the Trump organization. And look who's over there, right next to Donald Trump, is Jared Kushner, top Jewish Zionist, right there. Uh, Freaking married to the uh, son of Donald Trump. And they don't care about that stuff. They marry into They don't care about, about America that much. I mean, I don't know. He's doing a lot of positive things for America, Donald. Um, just because they're Jewish and Zionist doesn't mean that they are top criminals. Okay? These could be good Jewish Zionist guys or good, but it is Ashkenazi Zionists. And so that's, that's bad. That's not a good Jewish person. That's Ashkenazi Zionist. They work together to overthrow governments, control the government from the back door, and purchase off anyone who is going against them and stuff like that. So, according to that, um, it, it, you know, it's very bad, very dangerous. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a bad, dark side there. Very, very evil shit. Uh, controlling kind of stuff. But, you know, Donald Trump is doing a lot of stuff to, he's doing a lot of stuff to kind of free America in many ways. And talking a lot against these Ashkenazi Zionists, against the, they're one of the main group that has been kind of destroyed and makes everyone, pits everyone in teams, wants everyone fight against each other, all this evil stuff. And, and, and tons of evil schemes. Just, just drain the money, destroy the thing, the Federal Reserve. So, it's, it's really, it's really, I don't know, you know. I think there's a large patriot movement, the Q movement, all this stuff, and, and the Q plus is, is Donald Trump. Q plus has been discussed. The Q plus is is POTUS. Q is apparently JFK Jr. But we don't know. This is might be a you know a hoax. Uh, you know to get the Patriots to be behind it. You know standing behind it like yeah wow JFK man and JFK Jr. You know to get everyone kind of all these guys rallying behind that uh, wow you know JFK Jr. and but there's also some reality there is as well. The best psyop has some reality and it has, you know, into it. Uh, you know, like the best lie has some truth. The uh, best lie has some truth in it. So it, it's really, I mean, it's weird. It's really strange. We don't really know. But, um, yeah, there's, there's, there's photographs with Donald Trump next to JFK Jr. in the photograph. Um, that they're working together, they believe in making America great, making America freedom and stuff like that, so maybe he is. Uh, and a lot of what he's working on is, is, is stuff that JFK would have done to free America from this corruptive evil force. And again, some of these Ashkenazi Zionists may not be so antiquated that they want to keep all that evil stuff going. They may be open to ending uh, some of these kind of evil things or, or, or making it uh, more freedom but I don't think that they are real patriots as far as really really believing in, in patriotic stuff as far as you know going against the government they don't you know going different from what the government says no they are a part of it and you gotta follow the money if they're involved with that they're inside insiders in some format inside the government and uh, you know, making money from it and stuff like that, profiting, making money from it. So if they're profiting and making money from it, they're not going to be against it because uh, they're profiting and making money from it. Uh, board of directors or whatever, you know, they're they're a part of uh, making money from the black budget. The black budget is something around twenty to eighty billion dollars a year. That's a lot of money. This goes to black budgets, goes to uh, all CIA, NSA, all that stuff, uh, development of new technologies, DARPA, and running all kind of businesses involving uh, nano robots and, and, and sci-fi uh, jet engines and all kind of, you know, all that stuff. So if they're running these businesses, they're profiting from all that stuff. So they're not going to want that to stop, and they're making a lot of money. 
in some cases. In some cases, they're making some good money, whatever, 5000 per month or whatever, that's, that's enough. Um, and they don't want anything of that to stop. And they're on the side of government and whatever government says. They're not a patriot who kind of calls out everything about government and is, and is uh, you know, independent from the system. This is really what makes a kind of a true independent patriot. You can probably separate out independent patriots from, uh, you know, insider patriots. Insider patriots are in some format working for one of these agencies, for the military, something like that. And, you know, you can't go against your paycheck. If you're working for the military, you're not going to be an activist protesting Uncle Sam. They're going to come in there and say, hey, what are you doing? Okay, you need to stop doing it. You signed a contract not to speak of this and everything, you know, uh, military, you know, you know, secrecy or whatever, you know. So you can't be an activist. You're going to be just showing up to your post and doing what you're told. That's it. So... Again, the Q off, uh, Q and on movement was started possibly by, we don't really know who or whatever, but, you know, it's kind of a patriot movement. And there's a lot of truth to it. Like I said, the best lies have some truth to it. Like, look at what Hitler did, you know. Uh, um, he hated the Jewish. The Jewish had corrupted the money. The Jewish had... Uh, made hyperinflation in the 1920s over there. The Roaring Twenties and the end of the Twenties, the Great Depression, they made hyperinflation. The money was worthless. So that was a, one of the reasons he thinks that Jews are horrible and this is corrupting the money and everything. And there's some truth to that. Uh, and so there's some truth and there's some lie. Uh, you know, it's just, so that's crazy stuff. Very very crazy stuff and I don't know what the, what, the, what the QAnon movement really is it may be a movement to kind of keep an eye on the patriots and categorize who the patriots are you know the patriots come out of the woodwork or someone you know kind of uh, patriot guys uh, you know come out of the woodwork and then you know who these patriots are why would they want to do that um, uh, possibly I mean I don't know why would they want to do that that's not really what I think the main thing is about. I think that the deep staters are trying to kind of harass and silence the patriots because they don't like that. And the patriotic thing is a real movement. And Donald Trump is doing it part-time, part-time, not, not full-time. He's not a full-time you know, uh, activist. He has to, he's, he's in, the, in the White House and everything, managing things there, making things look good, and, and, and keeping things rolling, dealing with any issues that come up. Any of these, uh, anybody kind of talking against it, he'll 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 figure out what what it is and, and and try to put a good good face on it or keep things rolling and put a very good face on it, keep things rolling. Um, but the QAnon is because what's happened is America has become unbelievably corrupted, corrupted beyond belief under the Obama administration. And uh, getting President Trump in there was a last-ditch attempt to somehow save America, which which seems kind of impossible in the face of unprecedented corruption and destruction and schemes to destroy America from every angle, destroy the families, take all the money from them to drain the country of money. Um, in some ways. Um, you know, uh, everything made in China, all the factories closing, kind of shut it down. And this was the shadow, shadow reason for the elites. The elites want to do that. They want to make America this, this, this military, um, not military superpower anymore. The military superpower of America is kind of over. That's a secret. It's kind of over and fading away and, and, and going away as China and others become the kind of part of the global military superpower. Um, but Amer but yes, it, 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 they wanted to destroy America, the culture, the civilization, everything, in order to make it a police state. And now that the Patriot Movement is going on, 